Hi, I'm Emma. I am the founder of The Bloom Project, a flower shop in Clarendon Park. I opened my shop in 2018. I've always been a florist. From the age of 16, I've started working in flower shops. I'd worked in other people's flower shops for like nearly five years or about five years. And it just got to the point where I'd outgrown it and I just, I needed to do something myself. I was bubbling away with ideas and not being able to do that at the place that I worked. It was kind of like, it was the next step for me. It's just an extension of me and my creativity. And I like to think that when people are coming here or looking online that they know it's my shop and they know who I am. Whereas sometimes I think when you look at other flower shops, you don't know the people behind the business. Um, it just, it's, it can be very like corporate-y. Whereas I, I don't want to be seen like that. I want to be seen as like, just like a friendly neighborhood shop where people know me, they have a relationship with me. And it's just like a really open, safe space for people. It's like a little wardrobe of things we've got fresh flowers, house plants, do delivery service across Leicester, uh, covering all occasions, lots of weddings and events. I just thought that having the shop was the biggest thing I'd ever do, but actually like being able to buy my own house is just mind blown for me. So it never, it was scary, but it didn't seem out of reach. It didn't seem too scary. And I just kind of went with the flow. I'm very much the sort of person like, what's the worst that's gonna happen? Are you gonna die? No. So I'll just go for things and see what happens. Um, I had the security of my family behind me and like staying at home. But financially, yeah, it was it was scary because I had to get a business loan to do it and put all of my own savings into it. But then I was still quite young that my mum just said to me like, well, if you lose your money, you lose your money. Like you're still young, you can get that money back and it'll be fine. So I think I've just always yeah, I've just never felt afraid to do it. I've just gone for it. I've, I've always really trusted my gut instinct as well. And I know my industry really well. I know Leicester really well. I know my clientele. I know what sells, I know what doesn't sell. And yeah, it's gut instinct for me really. Long time goals, keep this place going. Just like afford my lifestyle with it. Um, have Lily here. Just make sure we both have a nice life really. I'm, I, I'm not too, I don't have like really big plans because I'm, I'm content and happy with what I've got. I love the freedom that the shop gives me. I love being able to change it around or do new things and I'm happy with that. I don't need to like have loads of shops and do lots of different things. I'm, I'm comfortable. I love it.